652 time for the morning sprint. The suspect of the New York subway shooting is scheduled to be in court today. Authorities arrested Frank James in Manhattan after a nearly 30 hour manhunt. Investigators say the 62 year old shot 10 people on a Brooklyn subway using a 9 millimeter handgun. You can find out more about how he was found and his Wisconsin connection at channel 3000.com. The city of Milwaukee officially has a new mayor. Cavalier Johnson sworn in yesterday. Johnson is the city's first elected African-American mayor and the first new mayor in nearly two decades. He was already the city's acting mayor after former mayor Tom Barrett became the U.S. ambassador to Luxembourg. Johnson will serve a shortened two-year term, completing Barrett's. The Wisconsin Supreme Court will settle how ballot drop boxes will be used this fall. Oral arguments were delivered yesterday. The case is meant to resolve the back and forth earlier this year that caused confusion for clerks and voters. The Wisconsin Election Commission suggested to clerks that drop boxes were okay without going through the more rigorous rulemaking process. The court could lay guidelines that would require the WEC to go through the legislature to make those calls. Josh and I are in the 414 celebrating opening day for the Brewers. He's still taking some flack for being a Minnesota Twins fan. We had to remind him they just lost 7-0 yesterday. <laughs> Not going to be what happens here at AmFam Field tonight. First pitch is 414 against the St. Louis Cardinals. Uh, you can buy tickets still. The cheapest right around $44. Those are for terrace seats. Fans who had tickets to that original March 31st opener will still have their tickets recognized tonight. If you're staying in the 608 but still want to watch or listen here is exactly how you can do just that you can tune in over on Valley Sports Wisconsin or listen in on the FM station 96 7 the AM station 1670 or the Brewers radio network thanks guys new this morning Tesla CEO Elon Musk offering to buy Twitter his offer is just over $54 a share that is a 43 billion dollar deal it comes after Musk became the largest shareholder last week at 9.2% Musk says Twitter has extraordinary potential, but it needs to be transformed as a private company first. The oil company Enbridge plans on moving an oil pipeline off of Wisconsin tribal lands. Enbridge is rerouting a segment of its Line 5 to meet the requirements of the Bad River Band of the Lake of Superior tribe of Chippewa to move the pipeline off of its reservation. The company says the efforts will create jobs in the area around the 41-mile pipeline project. An estimated $46 million will be spent specifically with native-owned businesses and communities. The CDC extending that travel mask mandate to May 3rd. That means masks will still be required in airports, on airplanes, and Madison buses for another two weeks. The mandate was set to expire on Monday, but it was extended since COVID cases are on the rise in some parts of the country. Don't mess with bats. That's the new message from the DNR advising you to leave those bats alone as they come out of hibernation. At times, bats may shiver to get their blood flowing or chatter, hiss, or hold their mouths open for a long time, which the advisory notes are healthy, natural behaviors as they awaken and warm up. In most cases, bats don't need human assistance, and the DNR recommends that you keep your distance. Headed out to Milwaukee today for the Brewers home opener. Look for temperatures staying into the 40s. It is going to be windy, wind gusts, 40, 45, maybe even 50 miles per hour as we go throughout today. We do have a wind advisory from 10 this morning until 7 p.m. This is as our system continues to rotate through, but we're dry at this point. We'll only see some passing cloud cover as some snow showers and flurries remain to our north. Temperatures, they're going to be increasing up into the 40s later on this afternoon. We do generally stay dry dry with sun, but a whole lot of wind, Chris Stanford. Yeah, windy and cool. Hey, uh, travel safe for that home opener. We'll be back tomorrow. Three Now First Born Weather is brought to you by Lazy Boy Home Furnishings and Decor.